Hello, my name is Zoe Tibbs. Welcome or welcome back. Today I will be reviewing one of my new all-time favorite musicals, Little Shop of Horrors, just in time for Halloween. Now in case you aren't familiar with this musical, it's set in the 1960s and written by Rick Ashburn, and it follows young flower shop worker Seymour Kelburn as he struggles to choose between his fame and the lives of others. I'm just going to start off by saying that this was honestly one of my best favorite performances that I have ever seen. And it was done by professional actors and professional technical crews, so you know it was good. Like, the set pieces were really immersive and big and bright, and they matched and complemented the lights by using a theme of green and purple, and that was just incredible. And then the chemistry and the character development between everyone in the cast was outstanding, and the harmonies were the essence of art in and of itself. Filling the role of Seymour was the one and only Nick Anastasia. Straight from the moment he stumbled on stage, you could tell just how devoted to his character that he was. Suddenly, Seymour stole the hearts of everyone. And what's more, he had incredible emotions and facial expressions from beginning to end. But most noticeably seen in Suddenly Seymour in Feed Me. Now, of course, what would this show have been without the iconic Greek chorus of the group? Ronette, Stefan, and Crystal, played by Khadija Royal, Karima Khoury, and Naomi Brath. These three were incredible. They worked extremely well together, and they really put the facials and reactions and just acting into their very stylized dance movements. They were very together the whole time from start to finish, and their harmonies were breathtaking. Now, if there's one thing this show teaches you, it's that not all plants are for feeding. But what does that mean? Watch the show to find out. Slowburn Theater Company will be performing the show at Slowburn Theater, located at the Broward Center for Performing Arts in Fort Lauderdale, all the way until October 30th. So get your tickets. And if you're a student, you're in luck because you, if you go to the show early, you're eligible to get student tickets, which are a lot cheaper than normal tickets. But fortunately, normal tickets start at $49, so that's still very, very affordable. So what are you waiting for? Go get your tickets!